Christmas Eve. It is currently 8 o'clock. I am grabbing my jacket because me and my grandfather are going to go get Starbucks. It is raining outside, which I don't know how that happened. Um, I live in the desert, so rain is like a shocking thing for us every time it happens. Um, so I'm getting like a one that a jacket that's like good for rain because it has the um, like wind wall and stuff and so the water just kind of um, repels against this material so anyways I'm gonna go get Starbucks and then I'll be back to finish getting ready do my makeup curl my hair all of that stuff so just getting okay getting all my stuff together. All right, catch up with you later. Hey guys, just got back from Starbucks. I got our pumpkin spice latte. Um, I wanna do a little chit chat, get ready with me just cause I'm worried um, that I will forget to vlog a lot today since it's a big like family day and stuff and we'll be doing a lot of stuff. Um, I need to go, my grandmother is gonna go get a massage now at nine o'clock. And then I need to pick her up at 10 o'clock. Um, and it's not very far from my house, so that's really nice. Um, and then I'll probably, I need to stop by the bank at some point and deposit some money for the cookies I ordered, which are going to be a little, I was supposed to pick those up at 11, but the girl texted me this morning and said that um, three of the cookies didn't like dry right or something like that. So she needs to redo them and they just take four hours to dry. And um, and um, then they should be ready to go and I can pick them up um, or she can bring them to me, she said, or whatever, we'll figure it out. I just need to um, figure out when that's going to be so that she's going to do them right now like around eight and um and then they'll take four hours to dry and whatever so um i guess let's see nine, 10, 11, 12. i guess by like 12 or so they should be ready maybe or somewhere around that time maybe a little bit later um however i told her i am going to be visiting my grandparents at one o'clock um but then I will be free till I have to be at my future in-laws at six o'clock, which is when I need the cookies by because um, that's what the cookies are for. I'm taking them to my future in-laws house. And basically the cookies look like they're shaped like presents and they have everybody's name on them. So I just, I like to get them a family gift because they are a big family. My um, fiance has four siblings and then his parents, you know, so they're five kids and four siblings. Um, and then all of their siblings have a significant other. And so it's hard to buy literally like 20 people something. Um, one of his siblings doesn't live here, so um, they came for Thanksgiving or for Christmas and they usually never are. Um, so we don't, uh, really have to worry about them being here today. So I didn't order them a cookie cause I'm not going to like mail out a cookie. I just think that sounds disastrous. Like if it breaks in the mail or something, you know, obviously. So plus I don't know like how long they stay good for, et cetera, et cetera. Um, cause I literally live across the country, but, um, um, person and then one for their significant other and also including his parents. And so, yeah, I ordered 10 cookies. They have their name on them. They're so Alrighty guys, I finished getting ready. Here is the fit. Really cute. I think anyways, um, I finished my hair and my makeup. I need to go pick up my grandmother from her massage and go to the bank real quick. And then um, I'm almost done with those photos. I've been working on those right after I got dressed. And I think I'm going to get those out today. Thank goodness. So I'm um, going to go pick up my grandmother, go to the bank, and then come back here and finish those photos. 
and move on with the rest of the day. Alrighty guys, it's about 10.30 a.m. I have not eaten breakfast yet, so I'm gonna do that. I just sent out that gallery to that client, so that's out of the way. So um, I'm going to go ahead and um, eat some breakfast, and then I'm gonna edit and upload yesterday's vlog, and then we'll see what time it is and go from there. Alrighty guys, just ate some breakfast, had some avocado toast. Now I'm going to go ahead and edit and upload yesterday's vlog so that way that's out of the way and maybe if I even have some extra time I'll get a head start on editing this vlog right here so that way tomorrow I don't have to do much at all um, since tomorrow is Christmas. So um, I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick. Hey guys, I'm back from my grandparents house and back from picking up the cookies. I want to show you guys how the cookies came out. I just wrapped them, but they're um, just in like a box so I can show you real quick. All right, so I just put them in this little gift box that I had, that I actually got cookies in one time. But here's what they look like, the little presents. They're all just like little gifts. They all just look like this. Um, they're either white or this like golden color. So they all look the same, but they're all super cute. So, yes, that's what they look like. Alrighty guys, so it is 3.30. Um, at 5.30 we're gonna leave to go to my future in-laws, but until then, just kind of going to be hanging out. Um, I'm not sure if I should sort gifts right now. So that way when we get home later, we can just sit down and open them. So I think I'll call my mom and get her opinion on that. But we'll see. The tree's looking so pretty right now, though. But yeah. I'm going to call my mom and see if that's what I should do. And if so, then we will do that. Alrighty, guys. So it's a no-go for separating gifts. So I don't know what to do with my life. Um, I have two hours. No one's home because they're at the store. And my dad had to go feed our horses. Mm. Bored. Probably going to edit this vlog. I should do that, yeah. I guess I'm going to edit this vlog up until this point. And then, yeah, actually, let me so show you our beautiful tree and all the gifts because it's really, really pretty. So this is our tree. I think I mentioned on here that we do a theme every year. Um, and this year we kind of sticked, we kind of tried to stick to mostly white. So all of our ornaments are mainly white. And I mean, of course, besides like the, um, you know, the traditional special ones that, um, you know, have our names on them or whatever from over the years but we mainly try to stick for white and then we also wanted um to incorporate metallic so we have rose gold we have um champagne gold we have you know the yellow gold we have silver as well let me find some silver oh this has silver in it silver glitter um these little feathers have white and then silver tips um, so yeah, there's, you know, all the, all the metallics in here as well. And so all of our wrapping paper kind of also represents that. So, um, all of our wrapping paper matches. So this one is a white with rose gold in it. And then, you know, some of them are white with silver accents, um, like this one. And then, you know, some are... Also gold, I don't think actually, oh yes, um, that one's gold there, um, this one has gold ribbon in it, so yeah, we incorporate all of them, this one has gold, um, foil on it as well, and on the edges, and so anyways, we try to match as best as possible, if you see stuff that isn't matching, like this one here that has red and these ones, um, these are actually from other people. That's why they don't match. They're not from us. Um, so yeah, any ones that don't match, 
tech, um, most likely are not from us. They're from other people and we've just put them under the tree to open. Like this one isn't our wrapping. So, um, that's from somebody else. And then of course the Kendra Scott, um, they did their own wrapping there at the store. Like I told you guys the other day when we went to get this one. So we just left it. Plus it has a, the white and then the gold, um, foiling goldish I think it's gold or silver I can't really tell I think it's champagne so it's a little bit of a light gold um it has that so it kind of goes with our theme you know a little bit but anyways yeah so most of our stuff um anything that doesn't match is just from other people you guys I just remembered we didn't do advent calendar yet so glad I remembered we are down to day one day one has been open since the day I bought this advent calendar. So we can finally let it be open. I have not seen what's inside it, but it is literally completely open and it is only connected right here. Like it's it's open all the way. So not much effort, literally. Here we go. All right, let's see what it is. And this is a super tiny oh it's from the brand hero this is from the same brand as those um pimple patches that i opened on day 10 so quite a while ago it says lightning wand dark spot brightening serum oh this is really cool it's um for when you have acne and you know you have acne scars and you have like dark spots this is actually very cool i thought that it was going to be like a mascara or a lipstick or something but this is a really cool this this advent calendar has surprised me literally every day except day four you guys knew day four i was like i know what this is and i need it so i opened it and was like day four and day six well even day six even though like it didn't surprise me what it was it was surprising like the brand it gave me and everything so this was a really good advent calendar you guys i think next year i'm gonna get the same advent calendar this is from target um it's 12 days of beauty from target it's a beauty advent calendar and it was really 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 good like really really good um this is very cool i've never had anything like this i've never tried anything like this so i am very happy all right you guys it is currently midnight it was so fun. I'm so tired. I am going to take off my makeup and head straight to bed. I will see you guys tomorrow for Christmas. Merry Christmas. See you guys tomorrow.